when you start talking about winning the hearts and minds, you have to be genuine in that. You can't be false or plastic. You have to be genuine in what you say. You can't overpromise. And, you know, we always were very careful not to say we're going to accomplish something. We'd always say this is what we're attempting to do. And so you don't want to overpromise something and then under deliver because you lost your opportunity to gain that bit of trust. And that correlates to a lot of customers and customer service that we deal with in today. 100%. You know, you want to under promise over deliver, but you also want to win the hearts and minds. And you think about the first time you come in to meet a customer, you know, you haven't met them. You don't know them. Hopefully your reputation and image has proceeded you before you arrive because you've done a great job of that. But even then, you still have to establish that rapport. And until you establish that rapport, you're going to still be looked at differently. Yeah. And so sometimes that can happen if we're talking about a disaster issue. That happens very quickly because now then you're the hero. You're coming in. They just want that pain to stop, whether it's the water on the floor or there's something like that, then that's your best opportunity to do that. And that's what we would do a lot of times. You know, we would come in and we establish that rapport by bringing something of value to them. And so that way you get a little foot in the door.